Ouvinte prevenido. Alex Escobar hosts Globo Esporte, a TV sports show that has big ratings in Brazil. The program airs on TV Globo, which has a market share of 180 million viewers, which translates to 90% of the Brazilian population. TV Globo will be relaying the live feed for all the matches and will have personnel in all the 12 World Cup host cities to cater for the Portuguese-speaking country. Escobar goes to work usually four hours before his afternoon show. The show, which encompasses other sporting disciplines, will be focused on football for one month during the World Cup. Escobar admits that the workload during the tournament will be intense. <laughs> As a sport presenter, I, I think the preparation, it's day by day, you know. Um, you have to watch to, uh, the, the, the matches, you have to come early to the TV. He was involved in the Confederations Cup last year, which is considered a dress rehearsal for the World Cup that starts in 11 days. Escobar usually prepares four hours for a show, but during the World Cup, his working schedules will have to change, especially during the opening rounds of the World Cup. 1, 1 p.m. I have to be here to watch the, the match. Then we have another match, 4 p.m. Then another match, 7 p.m. And after this, these three matches, we discuss the program. We choose what it's important for us to talk about. At least three World Cup matches will be taking place during the opening rounds with TV Globo, enjoying the perspective of 34 cameras within the stadium, as opposed to the 32 that was the case in South Africa. Escobar, as well as more than 2,000 staff will be involved in the World Cup, are likely to be leaving work at 1 a.m. daily. Lucas Leiva, o Lucas, do Paris Saint-Germain, e o Alain Kardec, do São Paulo. With less than a fortnight the start of the tournament, Escobar admits that his country still has a lot of issues to resolve, especially transport and the disquiet in the streets of the government spending. Some things that are not ready yet, like airports, it's... Uh, Good, um, it's not good for us to, to receive the world with the kind of airports that we have here. They are not ready to receive too many people. Despite the challenges, Escobar predicts his country to deliver a World Cup to remember, with a focus more on the pitch and not the sideshows. Reporting for Citizen Sports, I'm Bernard Ndong.